Hello and welcome. Today we're going to go through how to configure your Truvo Magento 2 extension. You've just completed the Truvo application process. What to do now? Once your account has been set up, you'll receive an email from our team with a link to our developer docs and three pieces of information. Your MID, your TID and your API token. From the developer docs, you're going to find the Magento 2 extension instructions. We suggest reading through these fully before getting started, but if you don't want to, you can follow along to this video. The extension installation part is going to need to be handled by someone who is familiar with installing Magento extensions and has access to your app code directory. We suggest passing this part of the installation onto them. Once you've installed the extension, you'll need to configure it, which we will take you through now. To start the configuration process, you need to log into your Magento 2 admin. From here, select Stores, Configuration, Sales, Payment Methods, and scroll down until you see Truvo and select Configure. Expand the credentials section. Here, you're going to add your live merchant ID, your live terminal ID, and your live API token, copying the information from the email you received. Next, expand the card payment option section and check that Truvo Payments has been enabled. Add a title. This is what your customers will see when choosing a payment method on your checkout page. Keep it short and simple. After adding the title, you need to give it a description. Use this to tell your customers a little bit more about the card options you offer. The rest of the configuration settings are completely up to you. Enabling pre-authorization allows you to take pre-authorized payments and capture them later on. Please note that in order to take pre-authorized payments, you need to have set this up during your application process. If you did not do this, please contact your support team for assistance in getting it set up. If you do enable pre-authorizations, but it hasn't been set up, your payments will fail. Enabling tokenization allows customers who have an account on your site to securely save their card details for convenient repeat purchases. Lastly, expand the advanced section and click on developer options. Here, we suggest that you enable logging as this will help you identify any issues that might arise with a payment. Finally, Save your configuration and you're ready to start accepting payments.